what is a legal dove field? You know, it asks that. You know, can I throw wheat on a pasture? No. Can't. No, it has to be a prepared ground. Could you drill it? Yeah. Yeah, you can drill it. But you, you can't can drill just, it or broadcast it. You can't just broadcast now, so it. Now, so let me ask you this. Can you spray, throw, and bush hog? Because that's the way a lot of people are doing that's note, kind of the buffalo note to, type. Yeah, it's kind yeah. of a lot along the buffalo. For what do if they you, call it? Throw and mow, yeah, or something like that. So I mean, that's that's a, that's that a way people a do it. Normal agriculture practice. You yeah, know, so you can do that. You, yeah, you could go out there. You could you could sow it, uh, bush hog it down, and let that wheat. But it has to be a grain that like wheat or millet that will or rye, not millet. I'm sorry. Yeah, wheat or because you wouldn't put millet down that time of year. Mm-hmm. No. You would, you might. I think the only place I saw it would be Japanese millet in a mud flat. Yeah, and that was for wild. Or well, for, even the uh, rye, no, you know, I've, yeah, fat, the rye yeah. you can't because it's not going <clears> to <throat> right. It well, I said rye. Oh, I keep saying that brown top millet. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Millet would not be a common big, practice. Right. So right. same sense, if you had a field and you sprayed it and burned it, because you put wheat that's on top. Prepped. Of it. Yeah, it's prepped. Yeah, it's prepped then. That's that a, might be getting a, a gray practice. area there, but I mean, it's that's prepped. a normal practice, and that's what a lot what of people it, do with wheat fields. They'll have a wheat field. It has to be a cover crop field. Though. Yeah, it has something to be that will grow in the winter. It could yeah. be something that would, you know, die just out. attract. Yeah, just yeah. attract. Just attract. That's yeah. that's the key because they consider that bait. Mm-hmm. You're baiting at that point. You're not doing a normal practice. Does it still say it has to be <clears> covered <throat> x amount of days before? The season, I guess if it's, I guess it doesn't it's have a, to be covered. If it's a broke field, you, if you break the field and you throw down, just say you just you went out there, you sprayed disc or tilled, and throw down wheat just on top of bare ground. All right, as long as you you got the ninety pound, no more than that, down on there. You ten days before is when you you can't throw it out the day before, right, right, and right. do it and hunt it the next right. day. Ten days prior to your hunt, it's got to be it's out. Got to be on the ground. So I guess they're figuring those ten days it's going to germinate, or either the birds going to go ahead and get it. Yeah, and you're not legally hunting over it. But what a lot of people don't realize is, a lot of times if you harvest a field and you just get it back down to dirt, you ain't got to throw nothing on it. Those, those doves are going to come in there and get the scraps dirt. and the dirt. That's what yeah. they want. So, I mean, having a big pile up in there ain't necessarily helping you that no. much. I mean, I definitely think we need to get some <clears throat> pea gravel though, and. Get that road gravelled right there in the middle of the dove field. <laughs> you might, I don't know, you might could fix a road. That, fix might a road. Be, that might be legal, but you couldn't just come out there and rock salt it. No, yeah. you, can, no you cannot throw down any kind of rock salt. <laughs> that is very illegal. We're making ice cream, yeah. homemade ice cream out there. In the dove field. Yeah. <laughs> That's where we might throw ice cream stand. Yeah. <laughs> but, too, I mean, I guess that changes state from state, so definitely check yeah. out what your local yeah, we're, we're not responsible is for your tickets. That we're talking about. That is the most important thing. Take away from this, go to your local state regulations and see what they say. That's because right. They will write you tickets for, for illegal field. 